December 29th of 2006, I got injured by a form of an IED. It was a convoy of uh, four vehicles. And as soon as the explosion happened, it blew me out of the vehicle, killed my driver, and got my gunner severely injured. Su esposa llamó a mi casa y su papá le dejó saber a, a, al papá de Juan y ya él me llamó a mí a mi, al trabajo y me dijo que Juan había tenido un accidente, pero no sabíamos cuál era la, la magnitud del accidente, qué tan grande era el accidente. The day that I got injured, uh, she received a call from my dad. And when my dad told her that uh, I had had a, an accident, she didn't know uh, the magnitude of it. I arrived at Walter Reed uh, Army Medical Center. I was unconscious for, um, for several weeks. And uh, when I woke up, um, I was still not there. I got sent to Richmond, Virginia to the McGuire VA Hospital, uh, where I spent uh, seven months. I went back to Walter Reed, where I continued my treatments. It was a process of lento, because he had multiple injuries. No fueron únicamente sus piernas, sino que también tuvo problemas con la columna, herida de la columna. Tuvo trauma cerebral y él la ha improvisado mucho, bastante, bastante. She said that at the beginning they didn't really give her any uh, good expectations um, because of the spinal cord and because of the traumatic brain injury. I have several challenges. Um, for example, for me to get into either the bathroom or into the bedrooms, I have to transfer, in, it's a process of three wheelchairs. I have to transfer from my manual chair into a, my power chair. With the power chair, I'm able to get through the hallway. Once I get in, into, the, in, into the bedroom, if I want to go into the bathroom, I have to transfer into another wheelchair that is um, a whole lot smaller uh, to be able to go in through the doorways from the bathroom. And even with the bathroom, we had to take the door off. I have to depend on my mother, uh, who helps me out with my daughter, uh, to put her in the bedroom that she sleeps in. Is Es difícil verlo a él eh, tener que hacer todo lo que, todas las maniobras que él tiene que, que él está haciendo, pasándose de una silla a otra y, y con la niña de él también. It is hard for her to see uh, all the limitations that I have. If I have the opportunity to have this home, um, it would have been really hard for me to be able to have my daughter. And now, she has a place that she could call home. I'm very surprised about all the volunteers. It's heartwarming, it's overwhelming, and it's very admirable. I didn't ask for this, I didn't ask to, to lose my legs, uh, but I also didn't ask for all the help that I'm getting. Having a house that will fit my needs is going to be tremendous. It's going to open so many opportunities for me and know that, that there's really no challenge that I cannot overcome. <laughs>